Hey everybody, back again, and our friends at Spotted Ghost have released a new app, uh, and it is a bell. So we are going to do a quick app review. Uh, for those that have watched my channel for a while, you recognize that door back there is the dungeon, and uh, it's an interesting spot. It's a cold night out tonight, so we're happy to be inside, and we're going to actually try putting the phone in there with the uh, bell app on see if anything happens. So let's get that set up. Let's show it to you because I always like to show you the new apps. It's going to be a super simple, super quick video this week. So let's get the app inside. But, uh, this place is creepy. Let's see, uh, see if we get anything. Let's go. Okay, we have my phone tucked in here. We're inside the dungeon room. Phone is in airplane mode. We'll just double check that. Yes, it is. Airplane mode. Do not move device. Calibrating. Calibrating. Okay. So now, I'm going to walk away. I wonder if I should leave this mic next to it and grab another microphone. Maybe, let's see, first, oh, I guess I have to turn on my volume. Let's turn on the volume. There we go. And we'll turn it up, back. Okay, I'm going to go, I'm going to take a walk out here. Grab an extra microphone, it's on. Set a microphone. Calibrating. So we've got a microphone. If the bell rings, we will hear it. I'm going to leave the dungeon. Turn the light off. Hopefully. If it goes off, we'll hear it. The hum from the machinery down here is something else. Let's flip this around. So yeah, it's just uh, an interesting app while it's in there running. We'll see if anything interacts with it. Hopefully I hear it. Uh, but you'll hear it in the audio too, because I've got both mics going. Shows, yep, both mics are feeding in. So. We have that. But uh, Ghost Stop, a store in the US, recently came out with a Ghost Bell device, and I'm thinking I might order one. Uh, but I want to see if the app works too. I'm really curious to know if the app works. Uh, if there's anybody in the dungeon right now, if you can interact with my phone, which is sitting on the boxes, it will make a dinging sound. Uh, I'm not sure if I will hear it out here, I'm not going to stand right under that light. It gets really bright on my head. The only thing I can say is I wish it had, uh, because I'm not running a camera watching it, I wish it had some sort of display that showed how many interactions you had. And I may, uh, if I talk to the guys from Spotted Ghost, which I do sometimes, I may suggest that as an update, just something that shows that there has been an interaction, some sort of history just because right now it doesn't look like there is anything. And I think, to me anyway, that's the only thing that's missing. And that's just because I don't always have a camera set up watching my phone. Uh, sometimes, it, like right now, I just leave it in that closed room and I'm only running with one camera today. So that would just be my one minor thing. So I have no idea if it's gone. I don't even know if I'll hear it past this door. We'll let it go for a few minutes, and if uh, if it did ding, then we'll hear it on the final video. This this school is actually one of the more haunted spots in Brampton, and a lot of the staff have told me 
uh, some really creepy stories and they are nice enough to let me in here on occasion to film. And we've been going for four minutes now, or roughly four minutes. No, probably closer to three because I blabbered and went and got a microphone. We'll let it go for five minutes. See if anything happens. Really curious to see if any sounds recorded from that room. Uh, I'm also, because I've got a microphone in there, recording any sounds in that room. If they do happen, you'll hear them on this, this recording. I don't need to sync up the, the audio at all. But uh, yeah, if anybody out there has tried the ghost bell from Ghosta, let me know. Uh, I am curious about it. It looks cool. Uh, just the look of it looks cool. I'm curious to know if it works. Uh, the problem I have with ordering from them is I usually have to pay a bunch in duties and taxes to get their stuff across the border into Canada uh, because they're US based. So see how that goes. All right, we've crossed the five minute mark on the recording here. Well, I'm going to switch back to look at what I'm looking at. We're going to grab the handle. Everything's still there, which is a plus. Put the light back on. So hopefully we had some interactions. That's what it sounds like. Maybe we had it while I was outside there. Anyway, let's, uh, let's close this out. There you have it. Super quick app test this week, uh, outside the dungeon. But, uh, it just feels weird down here. That room's always cold, but it just feels weird in this building. Anyway, that's it for this week. I don't know if it worked or not. I'll know when I watch this back, but I will be keeping the app. Uh, I do use the Spirit Music Box still fairly regularly, so I will keep the bell and try it some more places, see if we can get anything with it. To, yeah, check out Spotted Ghost. If you don't already follow them, uh, they release some interesting apps. And uh, from experience, the Music Box is very interesting. It seems to work. At least it gives you some thinking to do. Itch on my head. But yeah, I don't know. Like I said, super short video this week. I really wanted to get this app uh, while it was fresh because I know he just released it. So yeah, if you like this stuff, Please uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you know these videos are going live. And as always, let's find something. <laughs>